September 14th is just another stepping stone. It's just another opponent to me. But he know he's facing Floyd Mayweather. I'm facing just another opponent. Floyd Mayweather might be headed toward the tail end of his career, but even as a 36-year-old, he remains as outspoken as ever. In an exclusive one-on-one -on -one interview with Fox Sports analyst Peter Schrager, Mayweather discusses his legacy and role as a boxing pioneer prior to his fight this Saturday with Canelo Alvarez. He hasn't faced 42 Floyd Mayweathers because he'd be zero and 42. You have to be able to outmatch me mentally, and I'm the strongest mental fighter in the sport of boxing. September 14th, same more thing. I'm dedicated. I'm hungry. Can't nobody outbox me. 36 years old, you're <laughs> one of the highest paid athletes in the entire universe, <laughs> and yet you're still working harder, training harder than you ever have before. What drives you? To be the best ever, you know, to be an icon in the sport. You know, not just to be an icon in my sport, just to be, you know, a living legend. And, you know, I want my name to live on forever. So it takes a lot of hard work, a lot of belief, and it takes a, you know, a, a good team. You were incarcerated for over 60 days. That time there was no boxing, there was no <laughs> yes. Las Vegas. Yes. How did that impact you as a man? Tough times don't last, tough people do. Uh, I'm a strong individual, I can get through anything. There's only three ways you can learn hearing, seeing, and doing. So the main thing is you're, you're growing if you can learn from your mistakes, and I've learned from my mistakes. Do you have any regrets? Um, everything happens in life for a reason, so I don't, I don't regret anything. Las Vegas, you know, you've been known to go in and make some bets on some sports other than boxing. Football season's coming up. Is there a team? So are you looking out for a pick? What is your thought? There's a lot of good teams this year. Uh, I'll be making some pretty cool bets. Is there a team we should be looking for? Um, I can't, I don't really want to give my source because, you know, um, with me giving my source, that's going to cost money. So, you know, I can't get information on like that for free. You know, they say Mayweather pay better. So. <laughs> <laughs> got Ryan Braun baseball coming out and saying, yes, I was actually using something got caught. In football, HGH is a big issue. You've been adamant from the start about testing. How do you think that plays over into the boxing world? I think that I'm the pioneer in sports that came to the plate and said, you know what? Let's clean up sports, period. If you're the best and you're competing against the best, let's do it on an even playing field. I'm the face of boxing. You know, I've totally changed the sport to where, as you see, every fighter now that's in the sport of boxing is screaming, take the test, which is very, very important. My health is more important than anything because if I'm not healthy, I can't go out there and compete like I want to compete or give the fans what they want to see. When it's all said and done, 10 years from now, 20 years from now, what are the history books going to say about Floyd Mayweather? He was real. Um, he was real. He was honest. He gave it 100%. And he, he had unconditional love for the people that had unconditional love for him. This mixed martial arts world, that's taken a bite out of boxing's apple. You could say that people are now into that just as much as boxing. How do you view the sweet science and the future of the sport? Well, boxing is legendary. Boxing has been here. I don't know how many years, and boxing will live on. You know, like I said before, men lie, women lie, numbers don't lie. So you can just look at the numbers that Floyd Mayweather is doing. I'm doing incredible things in, in the sport of boxing. Mayweather Promotions is the past, the present, and the future of sports and entertainment. Mayweather is now our brand, basically. It's not just a last name, it's a brand. So we take one day at a time. That's the only thing we can do. September 14th, what should we expect from Floyd Mayweather? Go out there, execute the game plan, be smart, be first, and uh, be victorious. Last question here, you know, in the past you've had Justin Bieber, 50 Cent, Triple H. Any surprises up your sleeve? Who's going to be in your inner circle on September 14th? <laughs> well, it's like the best should only want to surround itself with the best. So uh, we just don't know, you know. It'll be a surprise. Boy, cool.